Hey, uh. Hello, everybody. Chapter 16 today. Hagar and Ishmael. <laughs> My hay fever is killing me, man. Now, Sarai, Abraham's wife, had borne him no children. But she had an Egyptian slave named Hagar. So she said to Abraham, the Lord has kept me from having children. Go see with my slut. Perhaps I can build a family through her. Abraham agreed to what Sarai had said. So after Abraham had been living in Canaan 10 years, Sarai, his wife, took her Egyptian slave, Hagar, and gave her to her husband to be his wife. He slept with Hagar and she conceived. I swear that's adultery, but okay. When she knew she was pregnant, she began to despise her mistress. No shit. Sorry. Sorry. <clears throat> then Sarah said to Abraham, You are responsible for the wrong I am suffering. I put my slave in your arms, and now she knows she is pregnant. She despises me. May the Lord... Judge between you and me. <laughs> your slave is in your hands, Abraham said. Do with her whatever you think best. Then Sarai ill-treated Hagar, so she fled from her. Don't be so deep. The angel of the Lord found Hagar near a spring in the desert. It was the spring that is beside the road of Shur. And he said, Hagar, slave or Sarai. Where have you come from, and where are you going? I am running away from my mistress, Sarai, she answered. No, she answered. Then the end of the Lord told her, Go back to your mistress and submit to her. The angel added, I will increase your descendants so much that they will be too numerous to count. The end of the Lord also said to her, you are now pregnant, and you'll give birth to our son. You shall name him Ishmael. For the Lord has heard of your misery. He will be a wild donkey for man. His hand will be against everyone, and everyone's hand against him. And he will live in hostility towards all his brothers. She gave this name to the Lord who spoke to her. You are the God who sees me, she said. For the far, she said, I have now seen the one who sees me. That is why the well was called Beer Lahai, Roy. It is still there between Kadesh and Breed. So Hagar, Hagar bore Abraham a son, and Abraham gave the name Ishmael to the son she had born. Is that like Muhammad or something? I don't know. Abraham was 86 years old when Hagar. Bump Ishmael. Damn. Gilf blood.